Yeah, that shield dude had to go first. Holy shit. Enough. Should do. With that, we can carve the travel rune to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. Got it, okay. There we go, I think it's right. You killed Maggie. That he did. He was a god, but you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps, but I. And his father's Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> Swan down. That one was like way up there. Hold up. Yeah, at least figure out how to get the chest on that. <laughs> hmm, okay. Got that too. Hey. How do I get back down there? Looks cool, and there's a chest in there. Cool. Some of these are hidden in clever locations. I don't see this one, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a pass on that one. Man. Found anything good in Fafnir's storeroom? Wait, like maybe we here a whetstone? Which way back? I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. If so, then keep up. Yes, sir. Hey, I just realized. 
Christ. Magni didn't come back to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. this does. Okay, we got that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Got it. Oh, no, no. Fishermen would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. Oh, okay, 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 so... <coughs> well, this might be really cool, eh? I can't reach it from here. Oh, oh, I don't know. There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit. There's another side. Hold on, little man.
Alright. Okay. Palm. We're almost there. Wait, is there something up here? Have I been up here before? Oh yeah, I have. what you chip a little dude I don't see nothing how do I hop back down not here oh I walk down die follow me Atreus everything we just did climbed around a dead giant wrote a giant falling hammer fought some bad gods what do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Yacht Knight. So we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye. But his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple, submerged in the lake for generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going anywhere. It seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. Hey, Mimir. Last we were in a boat, you had just started the story. What did you want to tell me about the long war? Both sides suffered tremendous losses. And for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? Mm. Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy. A certain Vanir goddess. Legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Vault is behind that magical law. Oh, 
Oh shit, hand three instead of two. That's how you know it's special. Wow. I can't believe we're setting foot in Tears Vault. Alright everybody, that's all the time I have for this episode of God of War. Hope you guys have been enjoying it, and if you have, please leave a like on the videos and subscribe for more. Take it easy out there everybody.